confusing for a lot of people. San Francisco and Napa are a step higher in this new tier system statewide. This means in school classes, you can go back to campus, could restart in less than two weeks. Let's bring in NBC Bay Area's Jackie Ward on campus for us in San Francisco. Atta Clevenger is a small private school on the border of Noe Valley and the Mission. It is confident that it can safely have students back inside their classrooms here. But it's not up to them. It's not even up to the governor. Having to lump them all together is a little bit like bringing a framing hammer to a, a, an acupuncture session. Benjamin Harrison is the director of operations at Atta Clevenger School. He said San Francisco's education scene is extremely diverse, and there shouldn't be a one-size-fits-all approach to what learning will look like for the rest of the year. Uh, every school is different. Every school has its own set of challenges. Whether those challenges stem from the size, the uh, the, the population, the demographics, the the parent community, the the teacher community. Atta Clevenger applied with the city for a waiver asking that its 130 students be allowed to return to their classrooms next Tuesday. Because it's a 20,000 square foot building, Harrison says teachers have been able to make it a safe, socially distant environment for everyone. What we risk here probably is breaking education that is going to require a certain amount of time to fix afterwards. However, from the, from the point of view of the city, that's all they've got is a framing hammer. Right? San Francisco's health department has told the school that its waiver application might take seven to 14 days to process. By that time, Ada Clevenger may be eligible to reopen under state guidelines, but it would still have to keep its doors closed because the city has the final say. Before school started, every teacher tested negative for the virus, and Ada Clevenger says it will continue to test its teachers four times more frequently required than the city. In San Francisco, Jackie Ward, NBC Bay Area News.